back in 2018, the media art community was already exploring these potentials. Um, in particular, Refik Anadol. And I invited Refik to give a talk at FIU um, before he became the rock star that he is today. And he was hallucinating images using these techniques um, known, as, known as GANs. Um, and we had speculated um, when we proposed the, uh, the British Pavilion, the, the Venice, Venice Biennale. I mean, it was meant to be focusing on, on the history of AI uh, from the UK because it, the UK had been a, a huge, um, probably the most principal country in terms of the early development of AI through Alan Turing and so on. Now it's at the States perhaps, but um, anyway, but we were focusing on that. Um, and we were speculating about the possibility of not just hallucinating images, but hallucinating buildings. Um, and we didn't get the commission, but what was interesting was that was that Refik Anadol then took the, the whole corpus of the work by the office, Sahadid Architects, and started to produce the, the, the first ever design that had been hallucinated using these the, using um, using GANs. Um, and that actually is the image that uh, we use in the front cover of my book of uh, a Zaha design. So uh, these things were, were kind of beginning to happen. Um, and strangely, actually, FIU has played an important role in that because we had someone called Daniel Bolojan, who's very, very talented and one of the leading AI and architecture experts in the world, if not the leading one, um, was a visiting professor at FIU, and he was working with another practice, Kopp Himmelblau, based in Vienna in Austria, where they were doing, taking things even further. They were working with more sophisticated software and so on, and they were really the world leaders. Uh, in fact, in my second book, the, 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 the issue of architectural design that I guest edited, we used an image of one of their um, projects, Deep Himmelblau, uh, on the front cover. Um, so uh, FIU actually has been the center of things uh, for some for some time. And I'd also say that we currently on the Doctor of Design program, we have someone called Wang Yu He, who's, um, um, who's from China. Um, she, start, she, uh, she worked for Rem Kohlhaas for OMA for, for many years, and her practice is called X Cool, which is to say X Kohlhaas. Um, and she really is the, <clears throat> the world leader in terms of software development for AI. Um, so somehow Southern Florida, because Daniel Bolojan is now a professor at FAU in Port Lauderdale, Southern Florida has actually been a really important sort of um, uh, space in which these ideas have been um, explored. Um, when you heard, actually wrote the first two books on AI and architecture in Chinese. Um, I wrote this, I published the second two books, in the, the, the ones, the first ones in English. So uh, we can, I think, claim to have been at the center of things for some time. But for sure, you know, nobody was a, a, aware of all this to begin with. They were not paying attention until ChatGPT came along and until Midjourney and Dali came along. And then suddenly everyone's sitting up and paying attention.